Hi guys, Mike here again. Welcome back to number six out of seven of the last sayings of Jesus. And if you haven't received your Christmas card in the mail yet, here it is just for you. That's your one just there. That's yours. It's got your name on the inside, but I won't show you because then you'll know everything. Anyway, uh, number six out of the last seven sayings of Jesus is John 19, 30. It is finished. Um, so John's account of the crucifixion now is totally complete. A simple statement, a one word statement. Uh, in English it is finished, but I'll tell you more about that in a minute. Um, so what happens with this sentence is it um, is just a natural uh, relief and satisfaction that the pain and agony of Jesus are over. Death will soon release him. Um, but John, the context that John uses it, it's deeper. Uh, for John, the way he's written it, it's that Jesus is in complete control. Jesus is not a victim of the crucifixion. He's in charge of the crucifixion. Uh, remember in John 10, 18, 19, 10 and 11, Jesus said, no one can take his life. So, near, so now, knowing that um, everything is totally complete um, and the will of the Father has been satisfied, he voluntarily lays down his life. Uh, the sixth word, or uh, that sixth saying there, uh, is a Greek word, tetelestai, which I'll put up somewhere on the screen, uh, which means it is finished. Uh, that's why we say in English, it is finished. So there's receipts going back to uh, that time and earlier uh, with the word tetelestai written across it, which means completely paid in full. So the word on Jesus' lips was quite significant. He said, it is finished, not I am finished. And, um, you know, we've got to communicate that sometimes when we talk about the gospel. Um, it is finished. The work is finished, not I am finished. So his redemptive work was completed. Um, he had been made for uh, sin for people, 2 Corinthians 5.21 and he had suffered the penalty of God's justice, which sin deserved. So even in the moment of his death, Jesus is the one who remains in complete control. So that is only moments just before he bowed his head and then spoke the last words, number seven. But I'll touch on that later. Bless you. Bye.